reputably rubbish on the origin of freakish marshmallows. You would think that the writers have more important things to think about. Watermelon, 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 watermelon. Gentlemen, please take your seats. We are about to begin. Puked on my shoe again. Thank you. I would like to hand the meeting over to Mr. Bell, who has an update about one of our children's serials featuring my personal favorite Irish stereotype. Thank you, Mr. Washburn. The traditional shapes have been the horseshoe, the shooting star, the moon, a green thing with an X, a buttocks, a whoopee cushion, and the severed head of a beast of burden. Standard things that children love to play with. As I would like to remind all of you, last time we discussed an effort to save costs by instead of cleaning out the old marshmallow forming machines, we would instead thrust into it the new color and whatever abomination would come out the bottom, we would simply release as a quote unquote limited edition. So what exactly is the problem? The one shape looks like my dog got into my granddaughter's chewing gum. The other shape looks like my dog got into the cat litter again. The third shape, I don't know if it's a tropical fish or a suppository. And I dare say, this is a mistake I've made too often. Who doesn't love a good suppository? I believe that demographic's already targeted by the fiber cereals. I think I have an idea. I went to see one of them talkie pictures. I have the poster here from the marquee. I like this idea. All in favor, join me in saying I. I. Hey. Hi. I. Woof. The eyes have it. May our little leprechaun friend enjoy his new theme. Thank you, gentlemen. I bought a oh, water crap. It's watermelon. I can't just on my shoe again. Watermelon. Watermelon. So watermelon. Nice. watermelon. Will never be with a prostitute again. Thank you for watching this talkie picture. Please leave a message down below, select the like picture, and subscribe to be a member of our community. Thank you.